Hi guys, I'm Shahzad and uh, welcome on our YouTube channel. Today we're going to discuss that how can you use the preferences settings or in simple words, how can you change the folder structure? How can you set up the GPU and some other kind of settings in Filmora 12? So how can you do that? Let's get started. Okay guys, so now I'm going to open the Filmora 12. Once you open the Filmora 12 setup, then you go to the preferences. So how can you do that? Just open a new project or open your existing project. I'm going to create a project so we can access the file. And now here, as you can see, you have the preferences. Just click on the preferences here. As you can see, you can change your language, appearance. If you use the light mode, just check and also click on the OK button. I usually use the dark mode. You can also have some other kind of settings here, like I have enabled the synchronizations, automatic synchronize favorite items to my accounts, help to improve. If you if this one, they gonna select some kind of informations from your Filmora and they're gonna improve the Filmora performance. If you go to the folder here, as you can see, these are the folders the Filmora currently is using. Like if you have installed the Filmora in your drive, I have installed the Filmora in my document drive. So as you can see, this is the Wondershare and this is the Filmora. These are the same folders available here. So if you want to change the folders, then you can change from here. Just click on the folder and select your folder and then select or click on the select folder button. That's it. So here you can change the folders and why you normally change the folders. Let's suppose you have installed the Filmora in your C drive and you have only just left the 20 GB or 10 GB. Let's suppose you have 10 GB in your C drive and let's suppose you are working on a project which have 200 GB. Then the system will tell you that it's greater than 10 GB. So that's why you always change the folder structure okay if you go to the editing you have default duration for your photo duration transitions and effects and freeze so for the timeline edit and if you are going to take the snapshot or the screenshot for your videos just select the format of the image and if you go to the save button here as you can see i am saying back up my projects every 5 minutes you can also change the minutes from here backup project file directory you can change the folder structure for your backup so this is the default project locations as you can see this is the default project location you can also change the default project locations if you go to the performance and here as you can see i have enabled these two so if i enable this one as you can see the system showing me two graphic cards i have the integrated intel ultra hd which is a default graphic card available in my laptop and also i have the dedicated graphic card for gtx 1650 for my laptop i'm saying enable hardware accelerator for video encoding also you can select the graphic card from here if you have only one the system shows you only one okay so now if you want to preview the render just click on the background render for the five seconds so the system always keep the render files here i'm just going to disable this one you can also enable this one automatically delete the render files let's suppose if you have enabled this one then you have to click on the this button or enable this button so the system automatically delete the render files out of the box for you okay if you want to accelerate your videos, you have to use the proxy. If you are working, if you are setting 3840 by 2160 and your video is crossing this limit or at least using this resolutions, then the Filmora use the proxy. And also I have enabled the automatically delete the proxy when the project is closed. You can also enable the play using latest rendering engine for the better performance. So these are the preferences settings available in the 
film or okay guys so in this way you can configure your settings by going to the preferences sections in filmora 12 so i hope guys you are enjoying our videos if you think we are doing good thumbs up feel free to share our courses with your friends especially on social networks and please support us by clicking the subscribe button and pressing the bell icon so you never miss any update if you are watching our videos on facebook please donate us some stars so we can continue our work so thank you for watching